The next demo is about UX Evaluator. So first and foremost, let's open RAS Client and open just a couple of applications. So I'm opening Paint and as well, I will open WordPad, uh, just as an example again of applications to play around. So I have two of them open uh, in my session and let's minimize for a moment and look into the RAS admin console. The changes that we have made, they're centered into the console itself. So let's maximize and see the new differences. If I scroll to the right, now we see more information related to logon duration, evaluator, the protocol I mentioned earlier, if it's TCP, UDP, session length, reconnections, uh, how much data has been going back and forth. This is like a bird's eye view, but if you want to have a detailed view first, you can just right click and you say full screen. Now we can have a, a true view of what's going on. I can right click again and go again now to session information. And here we see all of the metrics and you can of course export them. But what is very important here, this refreshes in real time or every few, every few seconds, we see latency, transport, how much bandwidth it has from my client to the server backend, and what kind of connection has been done through gateways. If we use any connections, how many gateways in the middle, what resources have been used. From a login perspective, we can see connection, authentication, host preparation, if we're using group policies, and so on. And if a user does not know what client and server or Windows uh, client version they're using, you also will be able to see from the screen. Again, you don't have to use the full screen option. You can just right click, go to show information. You can see that. And as well, like before, we can go to tasks and um, change the columns as you, need, as you wish to, to do that. When we go to monitoring settings, we can go to this option here. And now you can set what it's warning and critical. And you can pick and select the metrics that are going to have the color change throughout this particular administration screen. And the rest of the process is pretty much the same. If you have additional questions, please go to parallels.com slash RAS.